Hello guys, welcome back in the React.js with the just video tutorial and in this video tutorial we are going to learn how we can test the functions. Okay, so let's go for the code. So here is my app.js file. We are going to test this. So just remove this function from here. Okay, so this is the core code and uh, uh, we will going to test this code and uh, this is the code of the last video. So if you want to see that how we can uh, create the snapshot then you can watch your previous video link is given in the description box. Okay, so uh, I'm going to remove this code so that I can write the scratch code form for testing the functions. Alright, so just removing it and this is the app dot component here I and I just imported it here. Alright, so first of all I'm going to import the renderer and uh, if you are asking me uh, why i'm going to import in the render because it's able to uh, instantiate our component app okay so how we can install this then link is also given in the description box uh, this the command is given in the description box and if you want to uh, command from here then i'm going to show you this here also so just right here render and if you want to install this then you have to just uh, uh, use this command I'm I'm not going to use this because I already installed this and we have installed and this and the render will install in your system all right so now I'm going to write a test function okay so why test because test is help you to testing okay it's a very simple meaning so the first message is first parameter is an uh, uh, string for the message so I'm going to just write here function testing all right and the second parameter is an arrow and here we will uh, write our code okay so just let a component and in the component I'm going to take the renderer dot create dot create and in the create function just pass our app component so that it can instance it with the get instance function all right and after that I'm going to take uh, uh, one more variable with the let just I'm going to write here tree okay so here you can just simply write here component dot uh, data function all right what is the data function so this is the predefined uh, this is a user defined function that we are going to test okay so I am going to write here this data function and it will going to return like 10 all right so just match it it should be proper okay now this is the proper spelling that's my bad in the last time okay so after that I'm going to check here expected uh, and expected function will be expect uh, something like tree and uh, this is expectations by the function and to be uh, should be the output of the function so my output should be 10 why because it's returning the 10 here we will check that uh, how we can pass the parameters here and we can get the data from here to here also as in parameter okay so now just test this function for the testing just right here npm sorry npm test app dot test dot js and hit then enter and uh, let's see the output one case is failed here let's see why it is failed because the expected spelling is wrong expected now it should be fine uh, it's not expected it's expect I think now let's see now you can see that the test case is the pass here all right so if I am going to pass here uh, 11 then it would be fail why let's see I'll tell you 
expected 10 value because ex received this one and expecting this because it's uh, the tree function the data function is going to pass here 10 so let's say I'm going to expect here a parameter data and multiply with the 10 okay so multiply with the data okay so what with the uh, output here so output would be like uh, if I pass here 10 then output should be 10 multiplied by 100 uh, okay so if I pass here 10 then it, it should be 100 okay so let's check is it fine okay it's passed if I expecting there 99 or something else then it will be going to fail why because uh, the function going to pass here 10 and the 10 is multiplied by this one okay that's why so here this is the a simple video about how we can test the functions so if you have still any kind of confusion you can ask me in the comment box also don't forget to subscribe our channel and uh, please like this video and share as much as possible